You have to run a standard uh, under a certain standard that they have, and it's the top two uh, with times under that standard. Um, those are two that are selected to be able to go to FISU. So for my event, the 200 meters, uh, there's a whole bunch of people who are, you know, eligible to run. And then over the, we have a certain um, period of time between, like, let's say, four weeks to run the standard, or under the standard, sorry. And then it's, and it's a free-for-all. And the top two after that, um, they get to go to FISU. I competed in the previous one, 2011. It was in Shenzhen, China, and so that was pretty cool. Um, to be honest, I'm just happy that I made it. <laughs> I wasn't really sure that I was going to be able to make it again. So I don't even say there's too much I did different, to be honest. I think I did a pretty good job the first time I went. I just think I, did, I just had a bit of inexperience, um, just in terms of like certain, just handling some certain things about the aspects of the games in terms of rounds for us. So I think coming back with a bit more experience and, you know, with my coach, be working on some things in terms of that. And so I think I'd just be better prepared. I mean, Auto U, it helped me, uh, in, and I guess in a couple ways. I think one of the main ways it helped me, is, especially through school, is to be able to balance that school um, athlete kind of lifestyle. A lot of my professors have been very supportive, and especially um, my faculty, the Telford School of Management, they've really helped me in terms of my exams and getting everything um, kind of lined up. So I leave, I'll come back, and everything's kind of organized for me to come in and do what I need to do to be able to, you know, graduate or finish the courses and all that type of stuff. So really thankful to them. And then, you know, even the GGs too, just the experience of CIS and, um, you know, giving us the competitive uh, experience to be able to handle some of the stuff that we'll be facing when we go to uh, a games like the university games. Well, usually for FISA, you go to world championships or the Olympic games. Um, so that's one of my main things, especially this year, trying to qualify for the world championships again. Um, after FISU, uh, I mean, FISU is, is, is pretty much an Olympics in itself. So it's preparing you for something like the Olympic Games. If that's your, if your goal, you get kind of a little bit of a taste of it. I mean, nothing compares to the Olympic Games, but if you're able to get even, you know, like let's say you're preparing for a test, even if you have like a mock test or, you know, something to prepare for, you end up, when you have the real exam, a real test, you know, you're better prepared for it. So that's the good thing about FISU and uh, championships like that. So going to the Olympics is... Uh, I guess, you know, a dream for many athletes. And so I'm, sure I'm really lucky and really fortunate to be able to have gone. And so, um, you know, now it's just working hard now to go back again. And so the training and everything and doing what is required so I can go back again. And hopefully this time, you know, we come back with